Yeah. Diafra or nothing. Yeah. Those of you thinking that uh, election is the solution, you are just beating the bush. Because you cannot eat your cake and have it. You better join the moving train or you'll be left over. I regret you will be your bedrock because we need our freedom and then we are getting our freedom okay we have 57 days to go to our freedom and we must surely get it the d-day is nearing closer so you better join the train join the moving train that can never be stopped or you'll be left over and regret will be your bedrock like i said we are moving on we need our freedom we don't need election personal ambition can never supersede the resolve of the whole people of 70 million dear friends so you better think twice or you'll be left with regret thank you very much I'm just trying to celebrate a little because I know we are there. Those who can never see, can never see. Those who doesn't have foresight, their brain is messed up with a different kind of concussion. They cannot re reason. All they know is how much they can get, but they don't know the future. And they think they are living life in Nigeria. You can't live life with there's no portable light, no water system, no good road, no good hospital. Nothing is good. Even I'm hearing that the fuel petroleum is now costing almost 500 naira. All food stock, all essential commodities are all skyrocketing. And yet, in the middle of insecurity, you are dancing for a campaign. You are going to rally. And you think you think you are normal? If somebody call you an animal, you start screaming. He's even upgrading you because animal is more better than you. Why? Because if animal is living in a comfortable, uncomfortable place, he will leave that place. He will move and go to a place you feel comfortable. Okay. But those of you acting stupidly cannot reason. Chasing the wind, when your house is on fire, you are chasing the rat. You end up in regret. We are saying it now, you people think it's a joke. It, it will be, at last you will start coming for shelter. You will not get it. Because we know those of you who are acting stupid. You've been voting for how many years? You've been voting with your so-called P. PVC for how many years yet there is no change and those that you see who are coming up for election are all politicians who are being recycled none of them are brand new they all have entered one post up in in the governance and still they are still boasting saying they are going to do wonders ha how are you going to do wonders? We are not stupid. Those of, those of you that are believing in them can be stupid. Those of my kind are not stupid. Okay? I don't need to go to school to be, to be intelligent or to know. Peter we cannot do no shit. He's a man with no balls. He cannot even speak in the midst of uh, 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 distress. He cannot even speak for his people. A lot of people dying south is this man cannot come out boldly and say, Hey, you are killing my people, stop it. No, you can't say it. Whether you, you choose to go to the north and uh, see the IDPs and uh, talk to them. We all know that these are the election tricks that they use on you people. Who doesn't reason? We don't need that. You know, we've seen that for years. We're sick and tired of those nonsense. We need change and the change we need is total freedom and you people think that we are joking you will see it 
That's the, that's the that's the ball game. Believe whatever you want to believe. Carry your PVC, and they go and think whatever you want to think. At the ball end, we see who is going to laugh, and see who is going to cry. Okay. Thank you very much. That's all I want to say. God bless you. Go and change your brain so you can reason. Those of you who believe in us, God bless you. Thank you very much.